Well, good every morning, everyone. It's Matthew here for another wonderful field trip. And where I am right now is actually York Mills Valley Park. So the building right over here that I'm just showing, that is actually the south entrance to the York Mills subway station. So I'm right at York Mills and Young Street pretty much. And I decided, you know what, let's go exploring. Let's go exploring a little bit of the north end of the city. Easy access from the subway line, right? So now I'm actually just wandering through this little little wooded area here, right at the beginning of the park. And I'm not sure if the camera can pick it up, but I'm hearing the sounds of some rushing water. If I look deeper in here, I can see a little bit of a ravine or a little bit of a river. But I think if I look across the way, there's got to be some sort of rushing water. Well, we found a little bit of rushing water. It wasn't all that much though. Not like some sort of big waterfall or anything. But, you know, still pretty neat. And I mean, they call it York Mills, right? So, mills were like big kind of buildings right on the water, so like rivers or like anything like that where there's lots of rushing water. And mills were like buildings that had like big uh, water wheels right? Big water wheel. So as the water ran over them, it spun the wheel round and round and round. And then that actually helped to power these gears that help grind down things like flour and oats and everything. So that's what a mill was for. And they kept them right by the water. So they used the natural power, the natural energy of the rushing water to turn those wheels that then turned the other gears that used to like grind and crush down. So that's where old, you know, York Mills comes from and everything. So it made sense that there must have been water somewhere. Oh yeah, we've got a few trees that are already, they've already lost so many of their leaves, right? Starting to get bare. They're all around on the ground there, nice yellow leaves. And then look at these. We got a few of these trees here, kind of a, a reddy orange kind of color mixed in with the yellow and the green. So nice. Look at, see the ground's got a nice little cover of leaves already. Not quite enough for us to build a big pile and go and jump in them. Oh, but it's so much fun if you do that. Next time you get the chance, if you get to rake some leaves into a big pile, jump in them. Oh yes, it's so much fun. Maybe not right after a rainstorm though, then they get a little bit wet. Oh. Here I was busy talking about the rain and everything earlier. We had such strong winds and rain yesterday. And look at, I see this tree. This branch has been completely broken down. Let's try to see if we can get a good look at it. Oh wow, yes. So you can see where the fresh wood, it looks like it already had a big crack because the wood right here has been brown, right? It's been aged for quite some time. But then we see the lighter wood where it's been a fresh break. And that's where, right down here, where that fresh bright color, that's where the break happened. Yeah, it was some strong wind all right. Oh, Let's see if Matthew can get close in. <gasps> Look at that. Now I know it's harder to see in all the fall color, but that is a cardinal. And I know in the summer and the spring, the red of its colors would be so much more bright. But now with the changing of the fall colors, it kind of blends in a little bit better. Oh, it's flown away. Bye, cardinal. Hey, 
Okay, now look at this. We found right here in York Mills Valley Park, we have a bust of Charles William Jeffries. So this is to kind of signify that, you know, his passing and, you know, he was a very famous Canadian artist. And so actually, if you look right at his bust, that's what the statue is called when it's kind of of his upper body. We've actually got in his hands with the nice fresh flowers is a paintbrush. Actually, two paintbrushes. There's a little one and then a bigger one. So yeah, that's kind of let people know that he was an artist, you know, and he must have had a great attachment to this area for them to put his his statue in this park. It's a nice little garden. Yeah, and it's, as we can see, it's a nice, beautiful little section of the park. we got beautiful fall colors. Let's see. Wow. There we go. We've got some nice, beautiful water. Just kind of running down this little kind of trench. There's something very calming about watching it though. This is one of those moments where, you know, if you want to practice some of those breathing techniques, those meditation techniques, looking out, out over this nice, calm, moving water, this is one of those moments. And look at, we've got beautiful fall colors. Look at these nice yellows going on over here. Just amazing. Oh wow, oh my goodness. Look at, are you seeing all this amazing playground that we have here? And I don't know if you can see quite so well, but look at this big, tall, 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 tall tree. Plus, 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 plus. Let me zoom in a little bit. That hill over there, that is a nice hill for like tobogganing in the winter time. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, this is beautiful. Now, I'm so sorry, everyone. Matthew doesn't have cat his partner who usually helps record with Matthew for his field trips and he doesn't have a sister who also sometimes helps record. He's all by himself today. So I can't actually show you me playing on this amazing playground because how am I going to play on the playground and hold the camera at the same time? I know it's tough, but let's see. Let's see if I can film myself trying to climb these rocks. Look, okay, It's a little climbing wall. Ugh. Ugh. Oh my goodness, that was so much fun. Look at this, they got this amazing rock climbing wall. Two sides, two sides of it. And then you get right up to the top, to the tower there, and you say ding, 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 ding. And then look at on this side over here, if you don't want to climb back down, they've got the fire pole. And you grab hold and you go wee down to the bottom. Oh, that is so cool. And oh my goodness, look at slides. One slide and two slides. We're going to check out the slides in a moment, but first, I found some swings. Oh, I found swings. They're a little wet. They're a little wet from last night's rain. But look at, let me give it a little push. Let me give it a little push. Whee! Oh my goodness, that looks so much fun. These are what I'm biggest fan of. Look at this. Big, curly, curvy swa slide. You go from the top and you go zing. Boom, boom. Oh, this is so much fun. I'm so glad that I found this. I'm so glad that I came out today. And you know what? Because it's raining earlier in the morning and last night, nobody else is here. And it's kind of nice because then Matthew has a whole playground to himself. Ah. Oh, so cool. All right. 
I know it's a playground. I know that you've seen playgrounds before. You've probably even played in playgrounds before. But Matthew gets so excited about these things, he can't help it. It's just so much fun. So much fun. Now I want to check out this really, really big hill. Look at it. It's still so bright green. You know that it's October? It's October. I'm walking in leaves that have fallen. It's fall. And still, look at how bright and green this hill is. This is beautiful. Okay, so here I am actually it's, I think it's still part of the York Mills Valley Park in general, but it's like a, a little baby park inside of that park. It's called Jolly Miller Park. And way over there, there's some like nice old kind of ruins, so the old like remaining pieces of buildings and stuff. I'm going to go kind of check that out. First, I wanted to point out this amazing puddle. Look at it, it stretches so far down the parking lot. Now, silly Matthew, he's still in shoes. Silly Matthew, he's still in shorts. But look at that. He can't go jumping in this puddle. He's only got one pair of shoes and they are going to get so wet. But I know, I know some of you out there like to jump in puddles. So I thought if I at least showed this to you, you know, maybe, maybe you're already outside right now jumping in puddles while Matthew's filming this. Oh, I hope you are. And if you're not, I hope you get a chance to, because jumping in puddles is so much fun. But anyways, I wanted to share that with all of you. Anyways, I'm gonna get closer. I'm gonna go check out this building, okay? Well, as we can see, one of the benefits of Jolly Miller Park, just off from York Mills Valley Park, it's got great big green fields, right? Lots of nice shady trees, too. Perfect to come to have a picnic, play some soccer, maybe not fly a kite right here just because there's a lot of trees for the kite to get tangled up in. But goodness, so nice. Whoa, you see that great red tree over there? Oh my goodness, that is an amazing sighting of some fall colors. Now, the main reason why I wanted to come here actually is to come check this out. So. <clears throat> I thought it was an old building that has been like the remnants, so the remaining pieces of the old building are still here. But the more I'm looking at this stone here, it doesn't look old, it looks pretty new. I think, I think what people did was they decided to make this beautiful garden and make it look like it was an old building that had been fallen down and destroyed and then they made a garden around it. That's still pretty nice though. Could you imagine sitting here in the summertime, you got all these flowers all out, beautiful, birds chirping, butterflies, oh my goodness. Just beautiful and we've got all this green space all around us. I'm still pretty excited I came here. Who knows, when you come here you can pretend this is like a castle. Oh my goodness, this is the castle right here. <gasps> and may, I don't know, what, fairies or maybe monsters or dragons? <gasps> oh my goodness, so many amazing things. Well, all right, here I am and uh, I've got nice fall colors right behind me here. I'm so excited, but for Matthew, this has been Field Trip. We explored, oh my goodness, York Mills Valley Park, Jolly Miller Park. So there was two parks that we explored today. We got to see some beautiful fall colors. Remember when we saw that cardinal? Oh my goodness. And again, so amazing that the cardinal, the colors aren't as bright in the fall and in the winter. I want to say thank you so much for joining me on our amazing field trip today. I hope everyone's having a wonderful day. See you later. Bye.